Mildrinone is more frequently used nowadays with the cardiologist supporting us in the pathophysiologic study as well. And uh, it's a very useful drug in pulmonary hypertension where the systemic pressure is maintained. And uh, the, we should be careful that we are on either adequate dose of inotrope and uh, we also don't give the loading dose in this situation. So dose is 0 0.25 to 0 0.75 microgram per kg per minute. It's a type 3 phosphodiesterase receptor inhibitor and it increases the cyclic AMP level. So it mainly has an inotropic, lucitropic and a pulmonary vasodilator effect. Systemic vasodilation is possible. That's why we should be careful to avoid it in hypotension and in newborns, we should avoid the loading dose of uh, milrinone. So as we discussed, inotropic lucitropic effect with mild pulmonary vasodilatation and the pulmonary hypertension with the post pedial ligation situation as well, it's a good drug to use. Loading dose not needed while the action may take one to two hours. The side effects include relatively slow onset, tachycardia, hypotension if there is reduced intravascular volume or if you administer a loading dose. Platelet function, we should be careful in a premature baby as uh, it may cause bleeding. Um, decreased clearance with kidney function. I have used mildrinone in a few babies, especially in one baby with severe pulmonary hypertension uh, who responded very well. And uh, there is more and more uh, room for uh, cardiology reviews or support and echocardiography and we can consider using this. As I mentioned, there are uh, some situations where uh, prostaglandin can be considered as well to keep the duct open as a kind of uh, decompressing effect on the uh, right heart and uh, it's not very commonly used in this situation but we can consider that in certain situations refractory. This is the uh, reference from which these uh, inotrope related impact is taken. It's a very useful article and I have shared it on my Facebook group and the Telegram group as well. If you are not following that you can uh, subscribe to those as well. Uh, thank you. I hope uh, this lecture has been useful.